taxes and living for free in, uh, in beautiful Southern California. But then I moved up to Northern California, uh, but, but never a fund manager. I thought that was only for Wall Street or something. But uh, they introduced me to the idea of a fund. And uh, so two years ago, I launched a Better Capital Fund. So the usual uh, disclosures here. Um, so the, the first fund is called Better Capital Fund. And what we do is we do, we do we invest in debt. So if it, how many of you are flippers here? Okay, quite a few. Do you use uh, private money? Okay, so I most of what I do, 80% of my income comes from private money lending. So I lend to flippers in California, Tennessee, uh, uh, North Carolina, Texas, several states. And I lend them the money, and then we hired actually a Kim's company. They wrote up a PPM for us. And uh, now, to my platform, which I'm gonna show you in a second, other investors can come in and they can co-invest with me. Okay, so I'm gonna show you that in a second. That's, uh, so the power of networking. Uh, I wanna say about eight years ago, I was doing a meetup. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was doing a meetup in a place called San Leandro, California. And they, I, I, I got there early to set everything up and I saw a bunch of people uh, grabbing uh, beer and happy hour drinks and all that. Max was one of them. And we happened to sit next to each other, exchange business cards, uh, you know, exchange like what are you working on? And, and anyway, uh, with a handshake, no papers, we did a deal. Just a small deal in California. and. Uh, uh, he's like, yeah, I'll wire you the money, and I'm like, I found this deal, and you know, yeah, I'll, I'll send it half. Anyway, with a handshake. That was eight years ago, uh, and here are some of the benefits of, of that. Uh, so number one, we do all the paperwork, we do all the due diligence, we, we do all the sourcing, we do all the vetting of the borrowers and the, and the sponsors and so on and so forth. So. So you don't have to worry, the, the LPs, the investors don't have to worry about that part. We do all the collections, we do all the bookkeeping, accounting, legal, everything. The investors come in and they can invest in any deal that is on our platform, but they can invest with as little as $5,000, $10,000. They can split that up across uh, multiple deals and, um, and they have diversification. They can, if, if we have a, an apartment building in Dallas, they can invest in that. If we have self storage in, uh, in Oklahoma, they can invest in that. If we have debt in North Carolina, they can invest in that. So you can build a portfolio. And soon we're gonna get into uh, high end fix and flips as well. So uh, those are gonna be available. Uh, let me see, I'm gonna just, uh, I'm not gonna waste a lot of time, but on private money loans, uh, that's that's our bread and butter, right? We've got about uh, 30 or 40 loans on our platform. Um, so what we do is, you know, so this is what most banks pay, right? But as a private money lender on our platform, you run, you can earn about nine and a half to 10 percent, and you get paid monthly. Uh, anyway, this is a little bit about the structure. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you. happen to be an investor in my own fund. <laughs> so I'm going to show you a real live uh, demo of a real account. And um, so you, I would log in here. And here, here are the deals that are available, right? So you, you, could, you could have, you could come in here and see everything that's available on the platform. So this is a long, I just did in, uh, can we so stop them? So I, I, I've got more info. Here's some details about the loan. It pays 10%. So 
So let's say you got some money in a CD or a bank or you know losing it in crypto. <laughs> I know mine is like the headquarters for crypto, so it's okay. Uh, but uh, I think we do a little bit better than that. But anyway, you you, you can sleep better at night uh, with, with our we, we do very conservative loans. So here's a loan for that pays ten percent. So if your if your money's cut in the bank collecting um, one percent or half a percent or one percent. You can do a lot better with us, but you're committed to several things, right? Number one, you, you have to be an accredited investor, a 506C Reg D, uh, so you have to be accredited. The second thing is uh, you have to come in with at least $25,000, but once you come in with $25,000, you can build a portfolio. You can say five years, five years, five years. You can build a different portfolio. Uh, so, so that's kind of the uh, how the Better Capital Fund works. These are the current opportunities. Um, you can do apartments, so I can say equity. And for equity, you have uh, there's a property in Lincoln, Nebraska that's doing very well, and there's a property in uh, in uh, Texas, Dallas, Texas, Richardson that's doing very well. And then uh, you can look at your portfolio and all that, you can see where, where, I, where you invested, how much you've earned, and so on and so forth. So anyway, this is called a Better Capital Fund. I also have, uh, since then, I've launched uh, four other funds. And uh, they're all built similarly. And, uh, so, and one of them that we're about to launch is uh, focused on uh, high and fix and flips. So my partner, who's actually an investor in Better Capital Fund, she, uh, she, she, she invested about, she and her husband invested about 18 months ago. We became friends, and then I'm like, what are you doing? She's like, well, I do high-end fix and flips. And uh, so we, we are gonna launch, a, we've already launched a fund uh, to do that, uh, mostly in Southern California, Southern Florida, uh, Beverly Hills, Malibu, and San Francisco. So these are going to be high margin. The minimum will be the minimum uh, margin has to be a million dollars. Otherwise, she won't even look at the deal. But the margin has to be massive. So her last uh, project, she's expecting to on a fix and flip. Uh, profit $9.2 million. So uh, that's that's the kind of projects that we're looking into. Uh, and lastly, lastly, um, how many of you have a lot of friends? A lot of you, a lot of you. All right, a lot of you. All right. All right. So like, like, uh, like Kim was saying, uh, if you are doing, you, you have to- How to be a doing. capital raiser, competent. And, uh, uh, they have to have confidence in you uh, before they're going to invest in you. Uh, secondly, you have to be trustworthy, right? So they, they, if they're going to write you a check for a thousand or two thousand or two hundred thousand or a hundred thousand or two thousand dollars, you have to be you have to be trustworthy. And and thirdly, um, you have to be likable, right? So you could be you could be uh, trustworthy. You could be capable. But maybe you're not likable, like you know, <laughs> like me. No. But uh, or you could be likable and trustworthy, but you're not capable, right? They won't do business with you. So you have to have all three components, and then um, and then you have to you know have to raise raise quite a bit of money. And and, and capital raising never ends. It's like ongoing uh, process. Uh, but uh, the the people that do it well. Uh, that are good at it, they do extremely well. Uh, I'm going to be launching, so what happened is by now I've run uh, um, close to five fronts. One fund is uh, very big, it's about $85 million. The other funds are you know, in the 15 million to uh, 20 million dollar range. So uh, uh, real estate fund, uh, 
reach out to me. Uh, my, my email is uh, bobby at better capital fund or just find me here. Uh, but if you think that you would like to build a career as a fund manager, which means you get to invest in, you know, you have to be like, like you have to follow uh, Kim's guidelines. But it, it, it can work out pretty well, if you're, if, especially if you're good at capital raising. 